Good morning, Coloma Comics. It's Mr. Vane. Welcome back for the second session. Always keep moving at home. So today we're going to use a jump rope, and I'm going to show you how to do the limbo from some different heights. My assistant, Emily Vane, is with us today, and we're going to first start off right about at your neck. You need a couple people to do this, so hopefully you have a family, brothers and sisters, or maybe a friend over. All right, I'm going to show us the limbo. Good. Now we're going to bring it down to our belly. Don't forget to tighten it up. You can also play some music during this time. Now we're going to go just below, like below our waist. Now is where it gets a little bit harder and you have to be a little bit more flexible. And last, we're going to go all the way down like by our knees. Let's see if she can get all the way underneath, down by the knees. Almost, not quite. All right, then... We're going to separate the rope, and now we're going to do a single, some people call it double dutch, we're going to do a single dutch. Emily, you're going to stand sideways, yep, and she's going to jump. One, two, three. This is another way to keep moving and hopping. Good way to get your heart rate going. We're going to go a little bit faster and test her out and see how fast you can go. All right. Then we're going to take another rope, and we're going to try what's called double dutch. Two ropes. So you'll need you need two ropes at home to do this one. Let's try to hop in. Ready? No. Set. Go. Anyway, so with you need at least three people. And that was a little bit trickier, so that's for those of you who want a, a really good challenge. That's all for today. Stay healthy and keep moving.